That is hola as in hello in Portuguese. Why am I speaking Portuguese? Because it is time for the South America Grand Finals of UGC Highlander, and we have an all-Brazilian team, Squishers Esports, versus an all-Chilean team, Restaurante de Wesker. Foes of you familiar to Tia Kip TV should be familiar with that name. Anyway, let's get started and finish this language lesson, which I'm sure was horribly, horribly pronounced. Anyway, on Squishers Esports, we have Sonicro as Soldier, Vox as Engineer, PP. Wee Wee is Sniper, Dur is Pyro, Duke is Spy, Sonorax is Heavy, Asambrado is Medic, Consolo de Sonicro is Scout, and Ghost is on Dumbamam. Over on Restaurante is Wurud. If I could roll my R's better, I would, and it'd probably sound a lot more awesome. Uh, the, he's on Demo Man. We have Wayfarer as Medic. Me is Sniper. Workend is Heavy. Seth is Soldier. Dami is Spy. Zebes is Engineer. Quantic is uh, Pyro. And Panny. Pity Cancer. Pity Cancer. There we go. Is Scout. Let's get to the action and stop with the attempted pronunciation of uh, languages that are not familiar to me. Anyway, we're rocking it on Gully Wash. This is the first of best of three maps. Ghost getting out there relatively quickly and finding where his opposing demo man is. Gonna spam uh, choke there a little bit so far. Doing well and putting a lot of damage on Woodard who takes is goes down to 30 health right there and actually goes down as uh, Sonicro gets into choke and spams that as well. So, so far looking really good here for Squishers Esports uh, as four already down here for Red Team. So that's Restaurante and down goes their spy as well. Not, he well that's, uh, he's uh, there we go. Now goes Dammy. That's damn night for those of you who are not familiar with it. So a nice mid fight out of blue team for Squishers and we'll see how they continue to play and if they continue with this aggression. We'll get in on uh, whose cam do we want? PPP just went down as me was able to take him out. PP Wee Wee. I'm sorry, I said PPP. That's definitely not correct. But we will have an Uber exchange coming out here shortly. Workend is trying to be aggressive and trying to hold choke right here, but uh, it's going to be difficult uh, as both Ubers will go off at the same time. We do have word was actually dropped in that Uber exchange, so uh, Wayfarer not able to get the pop off in time. Blue Uber, oh, uh, they will be able to finish off this heavy that's working right there. Red Med did fall back, so uh, abandoning his heavy, probably the right choice, but that meant he is down and uh, now Squishers is in and definitely engaged here on the second point. Restaurante looks like they're not going to oh just miss that stab but that was Duke gets Wayfair just missed that stab i.e. I meant I missed on camera but uh, Duke with a nice pick right there we'll get back on his cam because he may go for a back cap but a nice cap going out here and Restaurante just not able to defend Duke is being super sneaky like he's gonna go for this heavy pick which would be huge oh no he was caught out um, but a nice attempt at least so Wayfair just now responding after that back stab so big big plays there for from this bad duke. Let's get in on the PP Wee Wee Cam, see what type of positioning he takes on this last point. Uh, looks like Sonorax went down to a backstab from Damn Knight, or what's he, he's, call, he's going by Dammy right now. Uh, blue, blue Uber is popped, just trying to get on a cam. Quantic doing some nice reflect action, just trying to keep Demo Man in the corner, but he goes down to stickies. Uh, blue team not out, headshot, and take me get. Gets the soldier right there. Uh, looks like Durr's trying to come in from behind. A nice attempt because it was, you know, Pyro just air blast everybody off the point. But two mini red players right here to get it done. Red team very, very hurt, but looks like they will be able to hold on. So Restaurante holding on right there. They did lose Wayfair, so... Uh it's going to be at another uber disadvantage. Didn't see his positioning right there. It looks like Restaurante wants to push out, so that's very aggressive. Uh, Blue did have only three people alive, but they got those respawns, so I'm not sure about this move by Restaurante. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> Big part would be getting Sonicro down, and he does indeed go down. So Restaurante is going to take this upper area, but they've got to worry about uh, not being back capped. And you know, it's not a bad idea to... Okay, so Garage is where uh, Squishers is really holding right now. So they're uh, 
Restaurante, it looks like they really want to push in on this, and I'm, 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 I'm worried, uh, but we'll see, especially since they don't have Uber, or they have a player advantage right now, three down, oh, but the soldier, oh my goodness, so Negro gets right in on Wayfarer, and uh, he's continuing on, trying to get this back gap, I would think, but uh, Word cannot catch up with him, finally, his stickies do, oh, but then Consolo to Sunicro. Uh, maybe it means re Avenger of Sunicro. Consolo, maybe that's what it means. But anyway, he did avenge his, his, his soldier there. Meanwhile, Asombrado managed to stay alive through all that nonsense. Has a super ready to go. There's only three up for Restaurante. They do get some respawns just in time for this defense. We'll see if they can hold. But Wayfarer right now, nowhere close to an Uber. Uh, and here comes the pop. Ghost is just gonna spam stickies right near takes down did wayfarer get away alive wayfarer actually did get away alive but it's not gonna matter only a few players up uh for restaurante and that is going to be the cap for scorchers esports take a quick look at scores right there i guess uh i want to get the red demo roll out see what word that's my attempt at a there he goes. <laughs> he's, of course, the last person to click through. So he's going to go through choke like he did last time. We'll see if he can stay alive. That's going to be essential because Ghost was just able to spam him out. He's going to move towards mid a little bit more right here and just continue spam out Garage. Um, but to get bombed by the sol soldier right there. Uh, and we'll have to fall back. Now we have Blue Soldier on the point that's Sunico, and he's going to try to go after this demo man or at least Medic, where the demo is positioned. Uh, but Squishers looking good, but Restaurante having, doing a better job of staying alive. Squishers actually now down a few players, um, but still being very aggressive. So they are hanging in there while Restaurante has fallen back to the garage. So I'm a little bit curious about this. Wayfarer has this 100%, as so does Asombra. Asombrado. Sorry about that. Uh, so we'll see who pops first. And indeed, it is going to be... Uh, where did they go? It is going to be the blue team. Uber already fading. They captured the point. Uh, I'm not sure why they pop. probably keep Met alive, so keep somebody alive, but that is going to put them at a huge disadvantage in terms of Uber. Uh, we'll see if Wayfarer can get this pop off in an advantageous position, because otherwise that uh, Uber is going to be wasted. And uh, just as I feared for Restaurante, they are popping and not doing really anything with this. Not sure what happened right there. There. I mean, at least with the Uber, you want to walk in here and try to deploy these stickies or make the demo man commit to something, but really nothing happening with that Uber from Restaurante. And now they're at a severe disadvantage. Sure, there are four players down for a blue team, but uh, there's respawns coming in already. And I mean, Restaurante didn't move off of it. So, really interesting um, stuff coming out here uh, after that mid fight. And so far, it looks like Squishers uh, pretty commanding in this round. But not all is lost, of course. I'll keep an eye on um, perhaps uh, Spies plays right there. Not gonna happen as for on the Uber. Not gonna happen to drop an Uber. And Squishers do get their pop off. Uh, engaging in this fight, well not really engaging, is the Restaurante. They're gonna fall back to their lobby, wait for that Uber to fade, not a bad idea. So not too many kills going off there. Word it did go down, the Dumb Man for Restaurante. So no sticks, they know that for sure. Uh, squishers know that. Um, but doing a good job keeping everybody overhealed and alive. Who is there? Durr needs some health. Uh, that uh, Pyro is gonna be essential for air blasting backwards, especially since Wayfarer has his Uber ready. So blue team gonna try to pop into lobby. Red has pretty much abandoned it, so that's interesting. So Restaurante is definitely gonna be uh, defensive right here. And excuse me while I try to get to uh, the camera I want. Uh, only four up though. Okay, they're just getting these response, so they might be able to hold on to this last uh, last point. We are only playing till four points or half an hour. Because this is just, because this is a best of three match. Best of three maps match, because it is the finals, of course. So, a uh, lot of action going on here right now. Medic got separated from his heavy, so he's gonna fall back into lobby. Probably will make it, no, unless the engine can go big. No, Zeebs goes down to a crossbow. Meanwhile, uh, a s looks like Consuelo, Consolo and Sunigro were both there on a point. <coughs> Excuse me about that. Um, but not able to get the cap. Uh, and actually some red time on a second right here. So Blue not able to maybe be as aggressive. Well, they're going to certainly try to be aggressive right here because red is uh, matching that aggression. They're trying to come out. Uh, we'll see whose aggression works best, I guess. 
as waiting for... Get the sentry. Come on, just get the sentry. You know you want to. There we go. PP Wee Wee getting the sentry. Uh, did I see a spy behind? But uh, looks like Asombrado is going to have this Uber ready to go and probably going to be pop it soon. Thinking they may have an advantage right here, but they really don't. In reality, the uh, red Uber goes off as well just in time to defend this. Um, some air blasting medics. Uh, really nice attempt right there, but Wayfair manages to get away alive. Really nobody in last right here for blue. Demo Man is going to try to get something going right here, but he is super, super hurt. Ghost probably won't survive that, and indeed he does go down. Panic hands are taking care of him. And again, Restaurante hangs on to this last point. Ouch. Ouch, ouch. Pee pee wee wee. <laughs> Getting that uh, Seth pick. Soldier is just trying to take a little bit further position. He maybe take upper... Uh, upper lobby attic right there, but not able to do so. Workin wants to do something like that as well. Uh, at least get the dispenser and indeed dispenser down. As well as Duke right there, so good spy checking from Workend. He wants to wrap around, try to get this demo man, but it's going to be a little bit of ring around the rosy, uh, trying to find him, but Ghost does go down. Seth finishes him off as right now player advantage in the hands of Restaurante. We'll see if they decide to push off. A little bit more response coming off for uh, Squishers. But it definitely looks like Restaurante wants to move off of this. This would be a good time for a back cap. Oh, a nice force right there, a Sinecro. Uh, so that means Blue uh, was forced on their pop as well. There was Word who forced the Blue pop. So good job from both Soldier and Demo on uh, opposite teams to force the pops. Right now it's a uh, Restaurante who's taking the brunt of this damage. Oh my goodness, working. He barely he doesn't survive. Ghost just spammed upstairs, and now Squishers has a five up. Restaurante has two. They do get some respawns. Ghost is gonna try to go for it. Oh, is he? No, he's deciding to play it safe and falling back. Probably, definitely the right idea right there. Uh, but appears we have a pause. I are back with the action scene. If uh, Squishers Esports able to push in here, or if this defense from Restaurante will hold for um, again me taking out PP Wee Wee right there. So a nice pick. The snipers on Gully Wash last can be brutal. But I think this Uber is about ready to go. Of course, uh, since the pause, we will uh, be having a little bit of HUD difficulties, but shouldn't be too long. The pause wasn't too long. Uh, and this Uber, you can tell it's sizzling, ready to go. We'll keep on this Necro cam as he whips his team into shape, literally getting some of this Uber as well. But he's just going to keep whipping that heavy onto the point. Oh, and gets the pick on Wayfarer. Really nice work right there. There's actually a demo man who got that final kill, but uh, definitely sending enough spam right there to do some damage. He's going to come in here, clean up on Seth as well. Can he finish off the demo man? His demo man gets in there. And only two up right now for Restaurante. Dammy is not going to get there in time. Word went down to Sunigra as well, and that is going to be another round win for Squishers Esports. So really nice work right there uh, from Sunigra, and I did some research during that pause, and Consolo means... Oh wait, Squishers is the Brazilian team. I looked up Consolo in Spanish. Well, Consolo in Spanish means uncomforted, apparently. Google Translate, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we're seeing Word get really spammed out right here, and his team is just falling back through Choke. Not good positioning uh, for this team. They actually are going to be able to get out here a little bit. Meanwhile, I don't know if you saw it, but Vox got two kills on his wrangled mini sentry. So r knowing how to run that key for Engineer here on a 5CP. Weird, I'm not sure. I think he lagged out there for a second um, and definitely killed himself, and down goes his... His, uh, his medic weight bear, a sombrado with that 100% able to stay alive. Taking a lot of damage. Uh, I think he took a body shot right there, but will be able to stay alive. Oh, he popped just in case. Uh, not a bad idea. Not what he wanted to do, of course, but uh, he is surviving and keeping his team alive. Let's see if they can push through Troke without this Uber. Um, it's just an NG <laughs> with a mini sentry. I mean, I, I feel bad saying that, but uh, yeah, Zeb's, Zeb's, you are Good try, but there's no way you're going to be able to take on the entire team. I don't think even the best of uh, the best, i.e. me. <laughs> uh, no, but even the best NGs would have had a problem with that. So Squishers just rolling through these points. 
We'll see if they can uh, make a move here on last, or will Restaurant be able to keep uh, this defense up? Wayfarer went down, so they have no medic. Didn't catch that pick, but that's going to be huge. Also, Weir just went down as well. He has a 15 second respawn time. Oh, it's going to be difficult. Can't lose the NG as well, but everybody going down. Oh my goodness, Ghost getting some nice stickies, some nice place to Roddy as well. We'll see if PPP, PP Wee Wee can get a pick as his team pushes in, but uh, he they might not even need to look at the Suniko right in on spawn, preventing anybody from getting out. Seth is going to come here and try to get it, but no, he runs into some stickies, and that is going to be another round win, a fast one for Squishers Esports. So we're on to the fourth round, 3-0 Squishers Esports right now, and it's going to be very, very difficult, but definitely possible for this Restaurante team to come back. Um... They have 15 minutes to do it because it's just a one half. They have a 30 minute time limit. We're gonna check in on the Seth cam. We've been seeing a lot of Sneaker. He takes a body shot and is super, super hurt. Has to fall back. Oh no, he's not gonna be able to do this. I doubt, but he is in the behind the lines right here. So we'll keep an eye on him. Maybe he'll do some. Something, something. Uh, we do see Warfare went down. Duke able to uh, pistol him down. And uh, maybe we should get to the action because right now. Seth is only one half of his team alive. He is gonna get in here. He has not been spotted yet. Oh, but he gets shot out of midair. Headshot by PP Wee Wee. Are you kidding me? This Squishers Esports team cannot be stopped right now. It is just a formidable force of aggression and momentum. Um, and Restaurantes just can't. They just can't get their a bearing. Oh, Consolo is going to be in here trying to get the med pick. Oh, Cap it goes for the med pick, gets the sniper pick. No big deal. Nobody sees him. He's going to get the Uber. And now, will Pretty Boy Pistol down this med who will not die? Wafer finally goes down. The Cap goes down too. Wow. So, momentum riding high for Squishers Esports. Look at those scores as it had just no chance for this Restaurante team, who had some good defenses in the couple, in the first couple rounds, but just were not able to keep up with, uh, what I said, the formidable force of Squishers Esports. So we will go on to the second map. We'll be right back. And we're back with the second map. We are here on CP Steel. Uh, I didn't get a chance to talk about this before because last round or last map was just so fast and furious. Didn't get a, a second to breathe, really. But uh, Gully Wash was Squisher Esports' choice of map. Um, I don't know too much about the team Squishers Esports, but they've been around since season six. And from the record, they have been very strong on five CP maps. This, however, Steel is a different story altogether. Uh, Restaurante actually uh, won against Squishers in the regular season 2-0. So this map, Steel, is Restaurante's pick. So I'm guessing they're hoping, fingers crossed, that they can uh, have a repeat performance of what they already did last round, last time they met on this map, which uh, was take it 2-0. So we just be playing one round of this. I uh, hope you guys know how Steel works because it is quite confusing. Not usually a map you'll see in playoffs, um, especially grand finals. Uh, and when teams can pick, just because it's it's considered to be one of those really random maps where even the best teams can be defeated by an, a crazy strategy from another team, um, and it generally doesn't reward skill. It rewards I don't know random play. Oh my goodness, Duke able to sneak in from behind and take down work end, and that is probably going to spell the end of this defense for point A. Point A generally not one you really care to commit to too much on defense uh, because it's harder to defend than B. B is is uh, not easy to defend, but uh, definitely easier. And we're seeing the sentry gun position moving from Zeb's. Uh, he had it before up here, which I like it as an aggressive position, but uh, falling back, I also I, I agree with that too. So both of these positions looking not too shabby. Not losing the medic or not having to pop their Uber on the first point is going to be huge here for Restaurante. So now they have an Uber to uh, be aggressive with to counter uh, this Squishers team. Now where is Squishers is the question. They're going through C or E, which is that final point to get to point B. Come in from behind, a very popular strategy. But right now they're calling attention to themselves by putting somebody on E. So I'm, I'm confused about that, but they're putting a lot of pressure there on E. Uh, well, times four, not sure who got up there. Ghost uh, running into some trouble right there as the respawns come out. Oh, hi is now the scout for Squishers. They had a change. Oh, but me has a sign for hi. Me and hi. It's uh, great names right there. PP 
and me, Sniper right there, going big, and we have yet to see these Ubers exchanged. Uh, Squisher is definitely thwarted in their attempt, and now there's definitely a stronger defense coming here from B. Uh, so we'll see if they can break through that, but again, Wayfarer has that Uber, so uh, may be able to hold on. Uh, Damn Knight trying to get in there and gets caught out in all of that spam. Oh, work end overextends and he goes down. Down goes Seth as well. Is there anybody to pop this Uber on? Uh, NG with a rescue ranger? That's not going to happen. And Wayfarer wisely runs away. I think he gets back into spawn right there. Uh, and yeah, he is back in spawn. Oh my goodness. Who got a level 3 up? Who is that? Who did that? That would be oh, the uh, engineer for defensive team. Offensive team. Oh my goodness, words. That's Vox, who did get that level 3 up. Uh, red team had to uber out of spawn to take it down. Uh, that is going to give a Sombrado a bit of an uber advantage because they popped so much earlier. So, interesting strategy. I love the level 3 at, uh, at E. But didn't work right there, me, with this killer headshot on Sonicro. Uh, getting a Sombrado as well! Gotta get on the me cam. He's just going crazy on this map. Um... Steel, I, a, one of the harder sniper maps I, I hear, just because the sight lines are sometimes really short, and sometimes I don't. You just have to know it really well. I guess me does, because he's just been going crazy. Um, not when I'm on his camera, of course. But uh, we'll check in on him in just a second. Right now, Restaurante is having problems with E. There looks like a scout there. Oh. But he gets sniped uh, by me, of course, uh, when I wasn't on his camera. Now I'm like legit mad. I can hear me clicking on my mouse. I'm mad at me for never getting snipes when I'm on his camera. But uh, anyway, despite the scout going down, uh, squishies still, squishers still have quite the presence here on E. Now we do have a soldier and scout. Um, Ty is going to get in there, try to get some more time. Sapper goes down on that level 3, which Vox is still trying to get going. Uh, he does get it back up, takes down Ninja Storm as he ran in there. But this blue team is just looking really- where's Wafer? Wafer has this 100% uber. Uh, they need to use it now to stop this cap. Remember, and steal. all you have to do is capture E and you win the round. Doesn't matter how many other points you have. They are pretty much uncontested right now. What is going on here? Heaton comes the uber finally, but it's gonna be too little too late. Oh my goodness. 4 minutes and 14 seconds for Squishers Esports. And that is going to be one heck of a time to overcome for Restaurante. Definitely, definitely possible. You saw that uh, Squishers still went for A and B before they got E. So potentially Restaurante could just go straight E and uh, cap this in... I've seen caps in less than a minute, I think. No, I don't think that's... I think it is possible to do less than a minute, but I think definitely less than two minutes. So definitely, definitely possible. It's just going to be very difficult. But Restaurante, they picked this map. They apparently know it well. Um, I don't understand why Squishers is holding A right here. I would put everything on E because you know that's where Restaurante is going to push. I would definitely build my level three on E because a scout. Mission begins in ten seconds. I just to to. Stop against that scout on E. I'm just I'm very curious about this. I'm very curious. Yes, so we'll see. We will see. Let's get in on, uh, oh, let's get on me's cam because he's going to go huge again. Maybe I, maybe Zeb's cam because he's got that, uh, was it level three going? And trying to help his team push forward. If he can get a teleporter down, definitely could have put his team and get them a good presence. Oh, damn Knight is, oh, not able to get it. He did get, no, that was Duke who got me uh, right there. So blue team, losing some players, but uh, they're going for A as well. And of course, when you do get A, you open up that connector through E uh, to get B. And of course, you have easier access to E. But again, I think it's just time for a straight E push right here. Uh, Uber's exchange on to the point. Down goes Word, um, but so down. But defensive heavy going down as well. Durr taking out working right there, so offensive heavy out of the picture. I'll uh, get it on Mies cam, see if he can't get something big. But uh, right now his team is losing time, already a minute down on the clock, and they have nothing to show for it. So this A hold turns out to be working for Squishers. Uh, 
let's see what's going on at B because there was a little bit of an attempt here to get through B from Restaurante, but so far nothing else. I think they should have popped their Uber trying to get through this. I mean, they just have a scout and a soldier, uh, well, but they are just not even trying. They're really pushing this E point, um, and uh, I don't think it's going to be fast enough. Remember, they're 415 oh, to beat, and already they're down about 230. Uh, Wayfair with 75%, is he out of spawn? He is indeed, so he's very vulnerable right now at Sombrado with uh, about 100, and there he goes. Wayfair also taking a bunch of damage, so having to fall back into spawn, he will survive that. But again, an Uber here is only going to do so much for this restaurant team. An Uber for uh, Squishers, though, is going to be able to do a lot, especially if it's on a Pyre who just going to go full out, and that is Durr. Oh, Sombrado does get caught out in the minigun fire and will go down. Um, a lot of players here on A, but again, you gotta capture E. There's no way they're gonna be able to get A through E in less than two minutes. Uh, so E is priority number one. Uh, I'm not sure why Squishers is, is building at, at B, but um, you know what? The defense worked. Maybe, I don't know. I just don't know. Oh, Sticky Trap taken down Zebs or Zebs right there. Damn Knight trying to figure out what's going on, but really, again, all... Oh, that was a spy. That was definitely a spy. Finally, we got some presence on E here from, I'm assuming, Scout. Uh, no, Soldier right there, okay. Soldier with the pain train to get that times two on the point. Definitely what they need, but they need everybody on the point with the, who has that ability. So... We're good, getting some nice uh, frags here right outside of spawn, but uh, he was not healed, so it goes down easily right there. Durr taking him out high, meanwhile getting a couple Ks as well. Uh, me not going to be able to survive that 60 seconds left, and oh boy, not looking good for Restaurante. Remember, this is the final round of this map, and uh, for those of you who watched the earlier map, it uh, is one nothing right now for Squishers, so Restaurante has to take this in order to force us to a third map, but it is looking less and less likely as time ticks down. Squisher is just looking extremely good. Their first deep, uh, offensive push was very nice. Oh my goodness, down goes Asombrado. Zebs, the engineer with the med pick. Uh, but will it be enough is the question. 23 seconds left, you have to have pretty much everybody on the point and that is not gonna happen if there's no side, or if there's no bridge for you to walk against me just going crazy. All right, me, let's, with 12 seconds left, Let's see a big snipe here out of me. All right, sorry. <laughs> sorry about that, it probably won't happen right now. High is just going to go ahead and get on the point. Uh, no, he's just gonna run around, but there is that level three sentry gun, not gonna happen. And Restaurante fails to capture E, and therefore Squishers Esports is the grand champions of South America UGC Highlander. So congratulations to Squishers Esports, uh, upending Restaurante de Wesker, who have had just an amazing run which you can see past games on Kip TV. So anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. Thanks to Sombrado who made sure this got cast. I definitely need more love for South American Highlander uh, and other Highlander leagues and divisions in general. So thanks for watching, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned something. And we'll see you next season.